in this uh, short video I'm gonna show you how to achieve this in as you can see just past half the night. So let's go to the tutorial. Three by three square. And then on the walls let's do two high walls. The walls will be too high. And then what we what you wanna do is you need to get a villager in here. You can either find a village and trap them in a hole and do it that way and build up around it. Or for the purpose of this video I'm just gonna get an egg from the creative menu. Build us in survival just to show you better and prove that it's easy to do in survival with the materials that you've got got yourself like this glass. And then just do a roof over him don't have to do this and you can use any material it doesn't have to be glass so that's the first part you have them in there okay so now I want to dig a too wide hole around it which is too deep that bit done. Alright, now we're going to add signs to this column. You can also use ladders just for this bit, but uh, it's better off to use signs because in a minute we're going to add something on which you can't do with ladders. So now we're going to aim at this one and put that there. That there. Crap. I'm going to get rid of that one. the sign's done. Now you want to dig out around here and just make and then go down uh, so it's three or four deep. Doesn't make too much difference. I can remove these. So now, what bucket there? What bucket? Bucket there. And then when the zombies fall in, they'll be pushed down here. Now we'll just build a little dip down here which is where the zombies will fall and they'll get stuck in here alright so now I've built, I just quickly built this little room and a way to get in here so the zombies will fall down here but then they'll just be able to walk through so you need to stop that so to do that Easy, just go like that. I'll fix that in a minute. I need to and then you want to add these slabs on the bottom. Uh, or that's a manual way which will get you XP. So now I'm going to show you a way to do this to not get XP but you'll get all the items and you won't have to do anything you can just sit at the bottom and get your loot so yeah okay so I've now dug a hole down there it's I, had, I changed it so it's about 30 blocks because I remembered that sometimes they get armor so this will just make sure they they definitely should die every time don't know why I cleared all of that very well uh, right so if we go back up to the top now one last 
last thing I forgot we have to do is to make sure they get pushed down there we need to put water in all four of these corners and that pushes and then that pushes down uh, the reason this works well I'll tell you that in a minute Right, we have mob spawning. The reason this works so well is because, as you can see, the zombies attract the villagers to get their doors, but there are no doors. Uh, so they get pushed down there. I'll go down so you can see it from here. Push down here. Oh, we already have one. And they fall. So, as you can see, this does work. We've already got three and it's been how long? Like, not very long at all, right? They can just bash away at their legs. And this is to show that it's an XP farm in mode 2. So, see my level right now. Also, when these zombies get hit, they call for help. So, um, more and more zombies will come. Okay, so I'm already level 3. Okay, I think that's enough to prove my point that this works well. You can see our uh, little puppy one, little puppy zombie. Aww. And you can see all these legs which you can either bash or we can test out the uh, other version of this. So I'll just remove these blocks. They fall down here. And you have lots of loot. Uh, we were unlucky there, we didn't get any armoured ones, so there's no gold or leather armour or anything, but from just a, like, what, a minute, we got a lot, and if I had bashed them, um, <laughs> Jesus Christ, that made me jump. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, you can see how awesome this is. So yeah, thanks for watching, bye bye.